Apparently, with this Brazilian bum bum cream, it's not just for the smell goods, okay? It's also supposed to help tighten your skin, make it firmer. Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. My name is Janika. I hope everyone's day is going extremely well. Mine is today we got a shower routine. I just purchased some new products, some Brazilian bum bum cream, and I'm like so freaking excited because, um... I told you, like, if y'all have seen my previous videos, I am a citrus girl. Like, I'm trying to get out of the citrus and get more into, like, the vanillas and the grown woman scents of the, the nuts and the pistachios and the caramels. And, you know, like, this is different. That's very different from the style of scent that I'm used to. But I'm open to it, right? So I'm open to it. And I went and got me, like, the travel-sized Brazilian Bum Bum Cream Shower Gel. I got the travel-sized Brazilian Bum Bum Cream Body Butter. And the travel size mist it all came together and it was $28 at Sephora so I'm super freaking hyped to try these products out and I also got me hold on hold on uh, a little scrub a little body scrub I don't know why I'm so excited to use this but I've never had it before I've never used it so I feel like it'd be good for the back for the feet you know what I'm saying like ooh. Okay, y'all ready to hop in the shower? Okay. First things first, I do make my own exfoliating body scrub. This body scrub is actually a salt scrub. It's Himalayan pink salt mixed with some vitamin E and some other oils. I keep a big container of my salt and sugar scrubs in the kitchen fridge. And I just use a smaller container when I'm going into the shower because the body scrub doesn't have a preservative in it. And so when sugar and oil comes in contact with water, it can mold and we don't want it to mold. So we just put it into a smaller container when we are taking our shower. And this is where we're starting off. We're just starting off by just scrubbing our body down, exfoliating, opening up the pores, making sure it's getting good and penetrated with the salt scrub. And you guys can see how it just moisturizes your skin so well, like I love it. I love, love, love exfoliating. You make sure you get the arms, the back, you get under your arms. You also want to make sure you get your legs, your feet, the bottom of your feet, um, your butt, your lady parts. What is the top part of your vagina called? It's not the vagina. What is it like the lip? I don't know. Get that top part. You just exfoliate really well all over your body, okay? And then we wash off all of that salt scrub and then we move on into the bar soap. So I have a four step shower routine. It starts with exfoliating and then we move to the bar soap and then we move to the shower gel or body wash and then we move to the cleansing wash. So after we exfoliated, we move on to our sensitive skin bar soap and we make sure we just wash off both the exfoliants and you know like the previous dirt from the day make sure we get our body good and clean and then we get to spin them like a rotisserie chicken let that soap just fall on down get good and happy now because guess what y'all we trying our brazilian shower gel i'm really happy can y'all tell i love new body products it smells so good I like this smell. My whole bathroom smells good. I want to use the um the brush. Should we use the brush? <laughs> so I decided to use the brush in the Brazilian shower gel to really get my feet more than anything i feel like the bottom of your feet give you the most problems as far as wanting it to be super smooth so i feel like the brush really helps get my feet to be super smooth and after that we just washed down washed our shower gel off y'all my bathroom smelled so amazing okay so with the honey pot you guys if y'all saw my last shower routine i was having trouble with the pump so i ended up just switching out a pump that I had in one of my other body washes and putting it in my Summer's Eve cleansing wash and it works just as well. So with my cleansing wash, I do just get all over my body and not just my lady parts because it balances your pH. So if your pH is gonna be balanced, it may as well be balanced all around. 
Okay, now it's time to moisturize our skin. We are out the shower. My neck looks bare. I feel like I should put my necklace on. Put my necklace on right quick. Cause I'm looking real burning neck. neck necklace on. I'm not gonna do anything to my face. I'm not gonna do my skincare routine cause I already did it. I don't wanna like do it again, but. Okay, so we are trying out our Brazilian bone bone cream, y'all. I'm so freaking excited. Like, I don't know. There are a lot of things in this world that make me happy and they just like bring me a lot of joy. And opening new beauty products, new lotions, new body oil, body scrub, any like beauty body products. Yeah, yeah. That, that definitely takes precedent. So just opening... I opened it actually earlier in the car to get a smell and I already smelled it. I love this so much, but it has this um, seal on top of it. We gonna use that baby because $28, but it's, we gonna use every single bit. And y'all, I tell you, so like it, my bathroom already smells like pistachio and salty caramel from the shower gel. Like it has my whole bathroom smelling amazing. And now to top it off with this bum bum Yes, baby. So we're gonna take this from the top first. We're just gonna get our arms. Oh, it goes on really smooth. Did y'all see that? I don't even know if y'all saw that, but that look at oh, it goes on really smooth. So looks like this on the inside, and we just gone. Okay, I don't know why I was thinking it would be like squishier, but it definitely has that hardened feel. That's good because that I means it stays on my finger without it falling off. But Oh, I love how smooth it glides on my skin. Maybe because I just got out of the shower and my body's already soft and feeling all good and luscious and stuff, but baby. I, we gonna put on our legs. Okay, I'm messing with this. It feels so good on my skin. Oh my God, and it smells amazing. I'm not just saying it because this is what I hear all the time. Like, no, this actually smells really good. I just realized I was so excited to put this lotion on. I didn't do my witch hazel. I forgot to do the witch hazel. Y'all know we got to do the witch hazel, but give me a second. We're going to go back to the witch hazel. Okay, so this is a cream. I still, it's kind of like lotion, right? I still like to put oil on um on top of my lotions because i just feel like it locks in the moisture and the smell so much more right so after we first applied this to our body the brazilian bum bum cream we're gonna go in with our osea andaria oil and add it as a second layer to lock in the moisture i feel like i don't know my, my skin feels better when it has oil on it y'all and i tell you this is citrus baby so like this oh oh it's giving summer, it's giving tropical, it's giving spring break, it's giving, I need to be on an island, a tropical island. Oh, y'all, this smells so freaking good. It's giving, I need to be in Tulum, Cancun. What Drake said, I need you out of Jamaica, relaxing. That's what I need to be doing right now, smelling like coconuts and palm orange trees. Y'all, listen, I think I just did something. I really, I really feel like I just did something. Like, it's the, it, uh, I put some on my legs, child. It, it's doing it for me. It really is. I really can't tell y'all how good I smell right now. Like, I wish y'all could experience it for yourself. Like, it's really giving tropical. So now, after we didn't put our lotion or our cream, on and then we done put our oil on we gonna go on top of the oil with the brazilian mist and this is pistachio and salted caramel brazilian crush charosa i don't know how to say the name c-h-e-i-r-o-s-a charosa i know you're supposed to roll the r's i don't know but it's a spray perfume hair and body fragrance mix I know a nice tip when you are spraying perfume fragrance on you or whatever is to put Vaseline on the areas you're going to spray. And supposedly that's supposed to hold the spray there and the smell there as long as possible. But I ran out of Vaseline. Ugh. 
got to go back to the dollar store. I ran out of Vaseline, but we're still going to just put this mist on. Let it, let's see how long it's going to last. Like, y'all, I'm so freaking... <laughs> Okay, we're gonna just put this on first of all. Uh, why do I feel like I was gonna die? I don't like spraying things that just like, duh, whatever. All right, so let's, ooh. Mm hmm. That's so crazy, y'all. Like, I promise I'm a citrus girl. And the fact that stuff like this that smells like way too grown woman ish for me smells amazing, I'm like so taken by surprise right now. Like, yes, this smells really good. It smells really good. I want to be in somebody's presence right now. I want, I want to go on a date. I feel like I'm, on a, I'm not. I'm not going to. I'm not gonna just make someone take me out these just because I'm hungry, and I want them to smell me. I'm not gonna do that. But I feel like that would be great. I listen. Okay. Anyway, let me finish. Put it here. Hmm. It's supposed to be a hair mist too, so I'm gonna wait till I get put my hair down, and I'm gonna let it spread all over. And I also took how much it all. Um, I always talk about how I can't, my skin can't even take all these fragrances, so I'm really overdoing it, I feel like. But I really want to put this on. If I was going on a date, I ain't going to do it. If I was going on a date or if I was going out for drinks or something like that, I would put this YSL Libre right on top of it. When I tell you back, when I walk up in a room, y'all going to know who it is type shit. Listen, and yeah. Let me see what scents are in here because I feel like this will just set it out. This is like a vanilla scent, but let me let me double check. Lavender Essence Orange Blossom and Musk Accord. So it's like a deep, woodsy, floral scent going along with my citrus scent going along with oh, oh, my pistachio and salted caramel. Can y'all just imagine the tropicalities that's going on up in here, okay? Like, just, listen, I know y'all ain't blessed to be in my presence right now, but, like, just imagine, I need to be in Jamaica, like Drake said, and in my opinion. Apparently, with this Brazilian bum bum cream, it's not just for the smell goods, okay? It's also supposed to help tighten your skin make it firmer make it feel a lot more smooth and i think you know we're gonna see if that happens let's see if it helps with the cellulite or whatever but i don't know it says it helps visibly tighten the appearance of skin on top of it smelling like this we're gonna see I, I think i probably got what like two more weeks of usage out of this probably depends on how much i use maybe i should like Use it sparingly. I don't know. But I need to be on vacation somewhere because I want to take my little travel pack with me. Anyway. Okay. So before we wrap this video up, we're going to end with our Dr. Teal's Aluminum Free Deodorants. Aluminum Free is the way to go. Put our deodorant on. I really wish... Why don't they make deodorant that's like black people's skin tone? I hate having those little white flakes. Even with clear deodorant, they leave the white flakes like, I don't know. Is there like a deodorant for black people's skin tone? Uh, and last but not least, our witch hey so Okay, hold on. So I have two different um witch hazels and I just kind of like, go between the two i can't really tell the difference to be quite honest but we're going to use our witch hazel we're going to take one of our cotton swabs that we got from dollar tree and this on there oh jesus and we just gonna wipe y'all Y'all know, listen, I hope y'all parents taught y'all how to wipe front to back, okay? Not, not back to front, not front to back, okay? Front to back, front to back. You know what I'm gonna do before I do that? I'm gonna actually go in with my um, Summer's Eve wipe and I'm gonna wipe that first. I'm gonna wipe with Summer's Eve first and then we're gonna go in with Witch Hazel just to get like the ultimate satisfaction of cleanliness. You know what? I'm just talking. You know, like when you be getting waxed <laughs> and you having a full conversation with your wax, like, hey, girl, how's it going? How's the kid? That's what I feel like I'm doing with y'all right now. And then we're going to use our cotton swab for the witch hazel. And 
and clean. All clean. I feel like my whole body is clean. I smell like a coconut next to an orange, next to a pistachio, next to some salted caramel on the beach in Jamaica with Drake. I don't know what's better than that. Anyway, thank y'all so much for watching this video. Make sure you give this video a like. Comment down below if y'all have any questions or suggestions. And go ahead and subscribe to this channel if you're into self-care tips and reviews. See y'all next time.